Can everyone hear me up the back? <laughs> um, so obviously it's early on a Wednesday morning. Everyone's had quite a few days already, so we're not, not surprised that this is um, uh, sparsely attended, shall we say. Uh, so what we are going to do, uh, this was always going to be a roundtable discussion. We're confused why we got this room as well. So um, uh, Ashley Noland, who's our Chief Development Officer, got it, of the Drupal Association, is just going to do a, a presentation so we have a recording of that. Um, but then we're just going to sit with you and have a chat and, and answer some questions. Uh, if there's confusion about who I am, my name's Owen Lansbury. I'm one of the uh, Drupal Association board members and I've been heavily involved in the uh, Certified Partner Program and, and Supporting Partner Program over the past couple of years. So, um, Ashley, it would be great to hear from you. Don't all clap at once either. That would be really loud. <laughs> Hey, blinded by the lights. So um, thanks, Owen. Appreciate that. So I'm Ashley Noland. I'm with the Drupal Association. I've been with the Drupal Association se since September. And so this is actually my first opportunity. DrupalCon is my first opportunity to meet staff and to meet the board and to meet a lot of the uh, partners that I've been working with either via Zoom or email. <laughs> so it's great to see people in person. Um, I'm glad that you all are showing interest in our Drupal certified program. Is everyone here currently a supporting partner? Part of it? Okay. No? Okay. Um, well, great. Great to have you here. Um, Drupal Certified Partners is essentially an extension of the supporting partner program. And so in addition to be able to contribute monetarily, the Drupal Certified Program also rewards those who can give contribution in code. Um, and so we have different levels of participation through the certified program. Um, and we can go ahead and kick off some of the slides. Oh, I do. Okay. There we go. Ooh, hey. It's fancy. So the need arose um, in 2019. Um, some of you may or may not heard um, Dree speak, Dree speaking about balancing makers and takers. Um, and so that is, there is a blog post that you can still um, go and access and read, but that is where um, the Drupal Certified Partner Program kind of spun out from. These are the current benefits right now um, in terms of being a Drupal Certified Partner. And I can let you all gaze at those. Um, and of course, this is in addition to the supporting partner, the current supporting partner benefits. Um, I think the, the biggest takeaway is the prioritization on our marketplace to be able to determine those who are giving back to code and supporting the DA monetarily. Um, so in terms of credibility, um, I don't want to read you know these slides verbatim, so I can I can let you kind of look through that. But I, I think you know Owen met with some of our board members and also some of our partner agencies to determine what would allow for a credibility, kind of a remake of our marketplace. Um, and so depending on your tier, this is um, where you would be determined in like your badges in addition to being a supporting partner. Um, so this is how you become a Drupal certified partner. It's, it's really not that hard. Our minimum contribution credit is 150 credits. And so that gets you at the bronze certified level. And then you go up you know, from there. Um, but you do have a, a separate badge and that is filtered in our marketplace to allow those supporting partners who are also Drupal certified to be first in the marketplace. Um, you complete a questionnaire um, from the staff. So there is an interview process and also you submit case studies. Um, and depending on what level you're at, so I think case studies for the bronze level is three or five. I can't remember. It, it's For bronze, it's one, okay. So again, all of this um, stemmed from being a maker and not just a taker. And it's not necessarily true that it's just 
takers who are giving to us monetarily, but we wanted to be able to, I know that code is very important and contribution to the project is very important. So we have to, um, you know, engage folks that way as well. And so that's where this program came from. Um, so hopefully there's a understanding of what the Drupal Certified Partner Program is. And uh, since there are some individuals here that are not even, or that are not currently supporting partners, I'd be happy to talk to you about that as well and to see where your organizations are in terms of being able to qualify for a, a Drupal Certified Partner Program. Yeah, so um, if you're interested in either of our programs, um, you can reach out to me by email. It's ashley at association.drupal.org, and I would be happy to work with you all. Um, so I think I mean, that's the end of the slides, but this is um, the exciting time where we get to have some Q&A and happy to take some questions. Um, either I'll be able to answer or Owen Lansbury will be able to answer. So we can go ahead and do that now. Thank you. <laughs>